So welcome back to the second video of installing Open Media Vault on an Western Digital Sentinel DX4000. In this video we will prepare our USB thumb drive with a Debian image that is able to be installed via the serial console. So therefore we first have to download our Debian image. You go to debian.org and then go to get Debian and there you get the 64-bit install image of Debian. And you have to have another software. I recommend Rufus. So go to rufus.akao.ie and scroll down and you find the Rufus Excel. Just download it and open it and then you have Rufus over here and at the top you select your drive then select GPT partition scheme for UEFI and give him a name and select your ISO image so so select your Debian image choose open and now you're ready to write your USB thumb drive just press start and now you get a question if you want to use ISO image mode or if you want to use DD image mode uh, please select ISO image mode as we have to do some changes to the files on the sticks afterwards and you get another warning that all files will be deleted just click OK and now everything will be written to the stick So now we are ready, just close it and go to the explorer, go to the USB thumb drive, there select boot, then grump and open grump CFG. I use notepad plus plus and we will copy the first menu entry, just select copy and paste. And as it will be a console install, we call it serial console install. Select VGA2 off and set console equals TTYS1 to make sure to use as one and not as zero. And now the board rate is set to 115200M8. And we also add console to the terminal output so that we can see the grump itself. Just select save. And now everything's prepared to install Debian onto our NAS.